Good morning, YouTube. Hey, everyone out there in survival land. How you doing? Oh, they're crispy. Oh, look at that. Look at them go. Now, these things ignite really quick. See how quick I just barely touched that. Hey, YouTube. Christopher Kaz here. Hey, what's going on out there today? I hope things are going well for you. Hey guys, I just want to bring you some new information about uh, the FBI and uh, some other agencies that, again, have thrown the American citizen under the bus. Um, the story reads here, FBI warns of threat from anti-government extremists, and this came out yesterday. It says, anti-government extremists opposed to paying taxes and following regulations pose a growing threat to local Law enforcement officers in the United States, the FBI warned on Monday. And here's what the scary part is. It says, uh, these extremists, sometimes known as sovereign citizens, believe that they can live outside any type of government authority, FBI agents said at a news conference. These extremists may refuse to pay taxes, defy government environmental regulations, and believe that the United States went bankrupt by going off the gold standard. It's crazy. Absolutely crazy. Um, you know, it, it's, it, it's, it's unbelievable what extent our government is going to, to just throw the American people out of the bus and label us all as terrorists just because we want to have this country be what it once was, not what it is now, and uh, links will be underneath. Um, you know, it's just uh, it's just crazy. Here's another one. FBI warns that Americans are now a threat to America. FBI warns that Americans are now a threat to America. Amazing. Okay, and it says. Um, Following the pattern of other provocative statements about the potential domestic terrorist threats from the Obama Justice Department, the Federal Bureau of Investigation has issued a statement exposing the threat of hundreds of thousands of sovereign citizens who can turn violent at the drop of a hat during encounters with police. Let me repeat that again. The Federal Bureau of Investigation along with Obama's Justice Department has issued a statement exposing the threat of hundreds of thousands of sovereign citizens who can turn violent at the drop of a hat during encounters with police. This is unbelievable, just unbelievable that, that they're going to come out with these stories. Again, throwing the United States citizens under the bus, okay? I found this PDF, and, and basically, this is what they tell you to watch out for, okay? It says, Communities Against Terrorism, and this was put together by the Bureau of Justice Assistance in accordance with the FBI. It says, what should I consider suspicious? And it says, people who, and it's got a colon there, are overly concerned about privacy attempts to shield the screen from view of others. Don't look at my computer! Oh my god! Always paying cash instead of using credit cards. They use a lot of lockout or blocker uh, things to distract other employees from looking at their computer. They act nervous or have inconsistent behaviors. <laughs> Who's watching me? They are observed switching SIM cards in their cell phone. Hey man, I was using the bathroom. I wasn't changing the SIM card. 
They travel illogical distances just to use Wi-Fi internet. <laughs> Activities on computers consist of, listen to this one, evidence of residential based internet providers such as Comcast, AOL, and AT&T. This thing goes on and on and on. And then there's the second part of it. It says, what should I do about it? <gasps> it says, gather information about the individual without drawing attention to yourself. Identify his or her license plate. Write it down. Description of the vehicle and where it was last seen. Do not collect any data that that person was using. Do not do any additional logging on the activity or monitor of communication. If something seems wrong, notify the police immediately. And last of all, don't jeopardize your safety. Links will be underneath. This is absolutely crazy. You know, we can't pay cash for anything. We can't do anything without being considered a terrorist or an extremist. Or we're labeled a sovereign citizen just because we want America to be what it once was. This is crazy people. The links will be underneath. Have a good day.